and next one what is the next to one more special character or addition character identified with concentrated sulfuric acid is it is oxidizing agent once again sulfuric acid is a mild oxidizing agent mild oxidizing agent the oxidation capacity of sulfuric acid is oxidation capacity of sulfuric acid h2so4 is in between in between hno3 and hcl it the strong oxidizing capacity or it is a mild oxidizing agent the oxidizing capacity of hts4 is in between hno3 and hcl here it is due to mild oxidizing character it is used to oxidize various types of metals and non metals let us have some examples when carbon reacted with sulfuric acid it converts into carbon disulfide carbon dioxide plus sulfur dioxide similarly when zinc reacted with concentrated sulfuric acid it converts into zinc sulfate plus the release of hydro hydronium or h plus ions this is what the reason whereas the last property of concentrated sulfuric acid there is sulfuric acid will have strong affinity towards the water molecule that means it can easily eliminate water molecule from any chemical substances when c11 or carbohydrate i would like to consider carbohydrate that is sugar c12 h22 o11 it is a sucrose when it reacted with concentrated sulfuric acid it can eliminate water molecules and releases 12c with the loss of 11h2o all this portion will be eliminated as from the molecule as water uh, as water and leftover is carbon or char left in the reaction so this is the fourth character of concentrated sulfuric acid that is that is concentrated sulfuric acid or sulfuric acid will have strong affinity towards the water it can easily absorb water molecules from the chemical substances due to this various types of gases are flown on surface of concentrated sulfuric acid to eliminate the percentage of water present in such gases so this is about properties of sulfuric acid once again all these properties due to four characters of sulfuric acid one is low volatility second one is oxidizing capacity third one is it is a strong acid fourth one is affinity towards the water so this is properties and next one is uses of sulfuric acid already we came across we came to know structure of sulfuric acid it is a tetrahedral geometry the geometry of sulfuric acid will be tetrahedral and next uses once again sulfuric acid is an important an important industrial chemical an important industrial chemical here nations industrial strength a nations industrial strength can be judged can be judged based on the quantity of 
quantity of H2SO4 quantity of H2SO4 it consumes it consumes and produces consumes and produces <coughs> So this is the most important statement in case of uses of sulfuric acid. Here the concentrated sulfuric acid will decide a nation's industrial strength because the quantity of uh, H2SO4 produced or consumed by a nation increases, its industrial strength also increases. Next, bulk quantity of, bulk quantity of sulfuric acid is used to produce used to produce hundreds of hundreds of different chemical substances different chemical substances in the laboratory or in a industry here concentrated sulfuric acid will show wide applications it is used in the manufacturing of manufacturing of fertilizers manufacturing of fertilizer like ammonium sulfate super sulfates type of fertilizers can be manufactured from concentrated sulfuric acid and also it is used in refining of refining of petroleum refining of petroleum and also concentrated sulfuric acid is used in preparation of paints, dye stuff intermediates, dye stuff intermediates and it is also used in metallurgic principles, metallurgic principles and also here it is used as starting material in the preparation of nitrocellulose. It is used in nitrocellulose preparation and it is used in batteries and it is also used as laboratory chemical. Laboratory chemical or laboratory reagent. So this is the most important cat, uh, uses that will be available for or exhibited by concentrated sulfuric acid.